If you're in biopharma or clinical research, you know how critical it is to comply with 21 CFR Part 11 and other GMP regulations. Hi, I am Kaya Genius, and I am frequently asked to address this topic concerning the Kaya Acuity Digital PCR System. Let me share the top three questions and concerns with you. Question 1. What is the difference between Kaya Acuity Software 2.0 and the newly released version 2.1 or higher. Kai Acuity Software 2.0 already offered support for 21 CFR Part 11 and GMP Annex 11 compliance, such as centralized user management, plate ownership, audit trail functionality, and basic signature features. As of version 2.1, the customization of roles and role-specific permissions greatly improved user management. In addition, it offers full electronic signature functionality and improves overall usability. Well, who doesn't like an upgrade? Let's have a look at question two. Do I need to purchase dedicated software to get full 21 CFR Part 11 support, or is this included in the standard Kayacuity software? There is no need for additional software. The 21 CFR Part 11 and Annex 11 support features come with a standard Kayacuity software, with constant improvements to user experience, additional features, and timely updates to the software. Let's have a look at the final question. Question 3. Where can I find more details about how Kayacuity software addresses each of the 21 CFR Part 11 clauses. A technical information document summarizes all details regarding the Kayacuity software and the corresponding 21 CFR Part 11 requirements. The document also includes an overview of responsibilities to fulfill individual needs. The file is downloadable from our website, or you can scan this QR code to get a copy. Thanks for watching. I will be back soon with another interesting topic. So stay tuned. Kyogen. Sample to insight.